Ooh. Ooh, this is looking nice, bro. 2011 anime, too, which is insane. When you see how beautiful this looks. Today, we're gonna check out episode four of Fate Zero. Wait, but first, if you enjoy the video, like, comment, subscribe to the channel so you can help us reach 100,000 subscribers by the end of the year. And you can find the full length as well as exclusives like this, which has been in the Patreon vault for over a year over on Patreon. You'll also find the rest of Fate Zero. You'll find Unlimited Blade Works and Heaven's Feel over on Patreon if that interests you. And you can find some other links down in the description if you care to check those out. Maybe just give it a shot. Uh, let's check out the reaction. I'm just charming. Dick, cancel this man. <laughs> wow. He is kind of cute, though. Part of me thinks maybe it's a, just that little mole right there, you know? That little mole is just like a nice like, little boop, little, little accent to, to, to cuten him up a little bit. I'm going to start putting a little, eh, a little little mole on my face. Saber's about to clap though, right? She got such a big old armor there. Ooh. Damn, she's strong with that. It's really cool that her sword is not a sword. It's like a, a force of nature, dude. The Derek Crane. That's what that thing's called? A Derek Crane? The fuck is a Derek Crane? Oh, uh, I really like this, dude. He, he little, he's, he's, he's scheming, bro. He's scheming a little bit. Okay. Still haven't seen Berserker, and I want to see him. I feel like he's going to be fucking badass, dude. Badass with that ass. She's pretty good with her single sword. That's kind of unfair. He got two weapons, man. Ooh. Damn. Kind of fucking badass, dude. It's kind of intense. Oh. Oh, she got his ass. Oh, interesting. You can't even see how long the fucking blade is, which is really sick. That's really sick that he's like switching between the two scopes, thermal and, and then like an actual like, you know, just like a zoom scope. Oh shit, the assassins are around. It's pretty crazy. His, his thing, assassin, is very like... I don't want to say intelligence, intel based. Like it can just gather all this information and present it to Assassin's Master in order to get him to like read the situation better, maybe come up with a plan. Maybe, man, maybe he's that, mm, you know, that Smarticles guy. So Saber's the strongest class. Interesting. Uh oh. And I, whoa. Wait, she's a homunculus? Hmm. Shit is interesting right now. Wait, so they're still working together. Was what he did getting attacked by Archer, was that like all part of the plan? That way he can draw the people out, spy on them while they spied on him and like what, he, what happened with them? Assassin Master and Archer Master are still good. They're on good terms. I think, I'm pretty sure. I feel like that's what's being implied. I want to know what who he is. You know? Who is he and his like uh I want to know his mythology and stuff, right? Lancer's like, bro, I'm trying! Give me some time! She's pretty good at this shit. Damn! 
Ooh. Noble Phantasm. Pretty obvious, yeah, dude. Otherwise, we would see your sword. Oh. What is the reason, though? Oh, because if she shows, shows off the sword, he'll be like, oh, shit, that's Excalibur. You must be Arthur, Arturia. Boom, 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 boom. But her seeing his, his spear, I don't... Did she realize who he is now? Damn, he is cocky as fuck just walking up. He's just like, I don't care. I'm ready. Ooh. Then he blasted all the wind off of it. Excalibur. That's crazy, dude. Ooh. Ooh, this shit is looking nice, bro. 2011 anime, too, which is insane. When you see how beautiful this shit looks. Damn! This shit is... The sparks are flying. Ooh, he got the moves! Oh, now he knows the length of her shit. Damn. What, she's just gotta basically wait for him to make a mistake? Yeah. A single misplaced attack. Oh, so she gotta get, she gotta, ah, she gotta take that shit a little bit and then she can, okay, okay. Okay, I believe. He sees that shit coming though. Okay, wait, what the fuck just happened? Ooh, healing. You thought, dude? That, bro, you think that his, like, special-ass weapon is gonna be... Oh, shit, he can... What? He can go through armor? That is broken. He bypasses armor? It severs magic. Oh, she said, she said, fuck the armor then. I guess I don't need this. Oh, she ready. No way this dude's dying right now, right? Absolutely no shot. Why are he backing up? Well, he kind of worried, huh? Oh, oh, he was preparing for his attack. Whoa, 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 whoa. Or so you think, motherfucker. Come on, girl. Okay. That was kind of scary. A little sketchy, I'm not gonna lie. And you got some eyes on you, bro. Mm, so not enough of them came through for him to feel like it's worthwhile to jump in there. Literally, this man is like, how many of them can I fight at the same time? Like, he just wants to fight everyone all at once. We like you, Alexander. We like you. Ouch. Victory without obliterate. Oh, okay. Interesting. Because, yeah. I mean, it's true. Like, you can't conquer something that's no longer there. I can see how that's part of his personality. Win and defeat the enemy 
causing as little damage to that enemy as you can. If it's a nation, causing as little disruption to that nation as you can. That way you do conquer, and then you've added that to your kingdom, if you will. Okay. I see it. Is no one going to be like, what the fuck is that? <laughs> Look at him. Oof. He cut, she cut your wrist. Ooh. I feel like he has the advantage with the spear, no? Oh, because his his blade cuts through magic. So I guess the wounds can't be healed by magic either. Damn, that's kind of OP, bro. Her abilities seem kind of defensive as opposed to offensive. Because hers is like she's like resistant to magic. Wait, 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 wait. But then wouldn't that be considered magic? I don't know. Maybe that's not considered magic. Oh, the yellow spear bears a curse. Oh, that's what I just said about her mold, uh, his mold, dude. I was like talking about, oh, the mold. It's got to be that mold that's, that makes him so cute. And like, <laughs> that's funny, dude. Teardrop mold beneath, beneath your right eye that confuses the hearts of women. That's funny. <laughs> Diarmuid of the love spot. I've never heard of that person in my life, dude. Bringing back the armor. Surprise, motherfuckers! Ryder has arrived. It's your boy. I like him. I like it, dude. I like him, dude. He's cocky. He's he's looks like a fucking badass. He's got a beard. Really, it's the beard is what sold me. That was awesome. In the end, all I'm trying to say, dope episode. I like these characters and I want to see more. I want to see more of these fights. I want to learn more about the story because there is a story back there. We're seeing all the masters and they're all plotting and they think everybody else is plotting and they're seeing the servants fight. And yeah, I'm excited, man. Um, I'd love to know what you all thought about this one down in the comments below. Though, again, I'm probably going to have watched all of Fate Zero. And as always, if you enjoyed the video, then like the video and subscribe to the channel with notifications on so you don't miss another one. Until next time, make sure you all keep it fresh. Peace.